because I already share that. Okay. My community. Let's go. Yeah. So. Uh, ah, hey. Yeah. Uh, actually, I did not even take it. So let me take it. You? Yeah. So, so do I recently I came to find out why Africa is poor. Yeah. And I found out I was reading a scripture. Okay. The book of Genesis chapter one. Uh -huh. uh, the Bible says that God says, Let us make a man in our own image, mm -hmm. in our own likeness, mm -hmm. so that they can dominate. Mm -hmm. Right, they can dominate the birds in the sky, mm -hmm. um, the fish in the oceans, yeah. and everything that goes like around the ground. Right. So basically, what the Bible says is talking about the resources. Yeah. Things under the ocean is the oil mm -hmm. of course, and yeah. other stuff. Yeah. Things under the ground is gold, diamond, diamond all that stuff. Yeah. On the air, you have, oh. you know, uh, yeah. wind for electricity. Mm -hmm. You have a uh, rain. You have all those stuff, right? <laughs> So basically the Bible was saying that, okay, God was saying, let us create a man in our own image, mm -hmm. man in our likeness, yeah. so that they can control, they can dominate the resources. Mm -hmm. So God, the only job that God gave to a man is to dominate the resources, to control the resources. Mm -hmm. But what happened in Africa? All the resources in Africa are not controlled, are not dominated by Africans. Mm -hmm. Someone else does that. Mm -hmm. If you go to the golding, mining industries, if you go through anywhere, oil, everything, mm -hmm. it's not controlled by our people. It's controlled by somebody else. Who to blame is us. Mm -hmm. Because this is our job for us to control. Mm -hmm. So you cannot expect to be wealthy country or wealthy continent or rich country if you're not controlling resources. Mm -hmm. right. Because that's the most expensive thing. That's the most wealthy thing you could ever find in the world. Mm -hmm. When you look at China, when you look at all these so-called developed countries, mm -hmm. I, I, developed country, mm -hmm. they control their own resources. That's why they are where they are. So the day Africa is going to wake up and start controlling its own resources, <laughs> we're never going to be the same again. Mm -hmm. Because we'll be able to call the shots. Mm -hmm. Right? Right yeah. now, somebody else does, and they're exchanging dollars. Mm -hmm. But dollar it losing its influence mm -hmm. here in Africa. Mm -hmm. So we don't really need paper money because mm -hmm. paper money is nothing. Mm -hmm. I don't need that. I need to control the resources. So as an African, I need to own land. As an African, I, we need to own mining companies. As an African, we need to own all these important places because mm. it's our own resources. Whoever owns it, uh, okay, you're not, whoever owns it, controls it. So you're going to launch your own army? Um, <laughs> we'll have one Africa, one Africa army. Okay, one Africa we need army. One Africa army. Once we have yeah. a united Africa, we need one Africa army. Uh, also, we need to to we need to twist okay. to cancel all the bad contracts that okay. have been made for the past sixty years yeah. with our leaders. Mm -hmm. No, let me say politicians, because mm -hmm. there's a big difference between politicians and leaders. Um, here in our continent, we have a lot of politicians. Yeah. Um, so we need to twist to cancel all those contracts and to to do it again. Because most of the contracts, I'll tell you, like 10% is for Africans mm -hmm. and 90% is for them. Wow. That's, that's, a kind of, that's insane. It, it is insane. Yeah. That's why we are where we are today. Mm -hmm. It's because of that. So we need to wake up. We need to control. We need to manage our resources. And it's biblical principle, mm -hmm. but also it's universal principle. Mm -hmm. You know, Sankara, Thomas Sankara, the mm -hmm. ex-president of Burkina Faso, he said, whoever controls you, uh, wh whoever feeds you controls you. Mm -hmm. That's another issue why Africa is poor because we always get loans and aids from outside. Mm -hmm. How can you expect to control your own house if someone else is building your house? Mm -hmm. If I build your house, I'm gonna sleep even with your wife. Of course, wow. That's, that's what happens in Africa. God damn. Wow. You know what I'm saying? So that so, was spicy, man. <laughs> so, so we we have this mentality of begging, mentality of asking. And we can never grow. We can never change this continent if someone else mm. is working for us. Mm -hmm. We need to be the one to build our own house. Mm. I'll tell you, I mean, you, you know the history of China. Mm -hmm. You know the history of China. It used to be a very poorest country mm -hmm. back in the days. But until they realized that, like, you know what, they're not perfect. Mm -hmm. You know, they have a system that, but at least it works for them. Mm -hmm. Who are we to judge? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And in Africa, the same thing. If we're going to wake up and say enough is enough, 
Mm. We're tired of how we've been living this mm. kind of life. We're tired of being victimizing ourselves. We're tired of being seen as you know poor, as you know useless. Yeah. Uh, you know we don't have influence in this world. Yeah. People they're just there to influence us, but we cannot influence them. Mm-hmm. We're tired of being the, the motherland of, you know, NGOs and all these, you know, aids and donations. We're tired of that. Mm-hmm. We need to start owning things. Yeah. We need to start creating things yeah. for the next generation. So is this like an official announcement of a potential coup in the future? Let, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> let, 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 let me just end. Okay, right yeah, you need to, and, you need to get and, it right. Yeah, you need to get and, it straight. No, 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 you might no. get assassinated by <laughs> FBI. <laughs> hey, you know, you know what? Um, and that's that's another thing. You know, yeah. we need to come together to be able to defend ourselves because the reason why Africa is not weak, but the reason why we seem to be weak is because we're divided. Mm. If you know, in Africa, we have more than 1.4 billion people. Wow. Africans. That's if crazy. we are one, we have a one strong army. Nobody's mm-hmm. going to mess up mm-hmm. with us because the rest of the world needs Africa. Mm-hmm. They need Africa resources. Mm-hmm. Right? So if we are one, we'll be able to make, to, 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 to stand on the decision making seats mm-hmm. and to be like, okay, what do you want? Okay, you're going to get 15%, 75% mm-hmm. is for us. But now we cannot do that because we beg. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So for me, I'll just end by saying this that. Politicians, things about are concerned about the next election, mm. but leaders are concerned about the next generation. Damn, Mike Drop. <laughs> Damn. <laughs>